Now, fighter of the year. This is a uh, our opinion. People in this. Our, our opinion. Fighter. I don't know why I put. I shouldn't have put Kevin Holland down. But he was down on he, the UFC roster too. He he, hit, to, he he. I ain't gonna lie. He he had. Uh, how can I say? He made it up the ladder. That's what I'm saying. That's why he Pretty was on fast. there. He's been on there for a while. So I would say, out of all these fighters, there was Kevin Holland. Uh, it's Devin's in there, right? Yep, yep. Uh, Devin's in Figueroa. They got Khabib. Yeah. How do you say his last name? Norman Megalov. Yeah, yeah, Norman Megalov, man. And now, no, yeah, that was those three. That, that was, that's from our opinion. Okay, from our opinion. Yeah. Got you. So. Some of these people are actually on the roster, though, for Fighter of the Year as far as UFC goes. But for our opinion, out of those three, first of all, let's talk about why we picked those three. Why do we personally? I like I like Kevin Holland's rise mm -hmm. recently. Recently, I know? do too. He he a badass. He likes he loves to talk shit, you know, and he backs it up, and especially with the way he knocked out uh, Jacare mm -hmm. that last fight. He knocked Jacare out with man from the ground. He did. From the ground, he, he knocked, he knocked him out. Because he was like, on the ground, and he got The way he, he did like, it. It was like a weird, yeah, it was like a weird, bye. The way he did it. He was on like, the ground, but he was getting up, and it was like, just rock. And you know, Jack Ray, he's such a uh, veteran. Yeah. And like, you so know, surprising people, and people, was, people was like, oh man, that's, this is going to be Kevin Holland. This is going to be Kevin Holland. This is going to be a challenge for a Kevin test, Holland. yeah. And like, and he, bro, he, he, he passed the test. He did. He really did. Yeah, man. So, and, uh. He's he's going up the ranks. I mess with Kevin for that. He he's he yeah he. I feel like I I, I feel like he's he can be he, one of the he's next gonna be ones. he's gonna be yeah he's gonna be one of the next. You can tell even by Jennifer he has that hunger and that energy for it. I mean he was talking. I mean at one point he was talking mess about uh uh Israel. Israel? <laughs> yeah. 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 Oh no, but that excuse me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but he still got food with stuff till he get up there. You yeah, know he did. He don't have to. You know. Yeah. Now I would personally say. Devious and Figueroa's on the map because the nigga can fight straight up. Excuse the N word for those who don't like it. He can fight. The man is a dog. When he steps into that ring, he has no friends. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Have you seen his highlights? Oh yeah, hell yeah. His highlights are vicious. Like, vicious. Like, they're scary. Like, I've never seen a man watch their highlights and was like, oh, I'm not fucking with my dude. And I think he's probably gonna be the, uh, well, Cause you know you know how uh, Mighty Mouse had that flyweight title for the long. Mighty Way had it for a he long. He might time. have it for a long time too. I think he will, but I would say he he would have to go a little bit harder though. Cause from the highlights, from what I seen, Brandon. That's why I say it's a respectable draw. Like, but Mighty Mouse was kind of the same way. He used to get. He he never. I think he he won a lot. He never had a respectful draw. But what I'm saying is that Figueroa. Dang near lost to Brandon almost. You feel what I'm saying? Right, right, and right. And Brandon, I'm not saying Brandon is soft. I'm not saying Brandon cannot compete with him. But from his highlights, he was just rocking people. Like, y'all go back and look at Devious and Figueroa's highlights. Like, the man is just... <laughs> and people just falling. Like, he's like the baby Mike Tyson or something. So that's why I'm like, if he has that kind of power, nobody in this weight class should really be able to mess with him. Mm -hmm. You feel what I'm saying? Right. That that's just my pick. So now let's talk about Khabib. Khabib. Even though Khabib only had one fight this year, I mean last year. At the same time, it's just like he's was it thirty and zero now? Yeah, the man's a dog. Thirty and zero. He's, he's uh, cold with it. He's undefeated, and he mm. just he he put Ga Gaethje away. What was that the second round? Yeah, he put him away. Yeah, man. So it's like he put him to sleep the second round just with ease, and everybody thought. You know, not everybody, but a lot, I mean, a lot of people, lot of people yeah, thought Gaethje was gonna be a, a good challenge thought. for him. But but it wasn't like, at all. but Gaethje, and during that, I don't want to talk too much about that fight. But Gaethje was too afraid to take down mm -hmm. to uh, even put his head in, in the game. You yeah. know what I'm saying? He was too. I remember that fight. I was like, oh man, this ain't the same Gaethje. I, I remember know. that fight though. So, and it, but think about it. Khabib had so much to fight for. That Gaethje had no chance to me. That that's why I'm like, right. Khabib is a he's a he's a legend already. Right. Khabib is just a legend to every like. I don't know. Right. You, you want to take a respectful Russia, a person who's first has Russian pride, can fight his ass off, 
and Dan is still a stand-up person. You know what I mean? Right, right. I'm not gonna say all Russians are like this aggressive, like. But another thing, cocky though, another person, thing, though, he's he's a devout Muslim, man. He's I think devout, that helps. But yeah. Still, so but still, him like, being a devout Muslim that shows in his character. That shows in his character by all means, and that's why I respect the man so much. But it's just most people when you think Russian, especially in America, we think oh they're a, they're a spy or 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 they're just this. <laughs> This big ass wrestler that just wants to walk around and bully everybody, right? Yeah. Uh, like, nah, bro. Like, he really, for me, and I think for maybe a lot of Americans, he really showed that Russia isn't this country to where they just shooting people and carrying bricks in the cold and just getting on buses <laughs> doing nothing. You know what I mean? Yeah. Wrestling bears all day. Like, nigga, what? <laughs> all these stereotypes they have, like, Khabib's that man. That's all I'm saying. So, yeah. out of those three, who are you picking for Fighter of the Year? I would say that would say Division Figueroa, but since his last fight came out to a draw, but I can't say that. So I say Khabib. Khabib. Retired, undefeated. Like you said, he had the most of 5-4. He put his opponent out, out of way in the second round. So like I'm it. like, I know people are gonna be like, I only fought once. But I don't care. <laughs> Cause they say they retired, but I feel like enough with enough money, enough purpose behind it, he could, uh, he could fight GSP. Who could be? Yeah. Oh, no, man. Yeah, yeah, man. Cause, oh, hey, man, no, remember, man. That, that was his dad's uh, dream fight. I, I can see it. So, if Dana, like said with enough money if Dana, it, Dana, talk, not even, they don't really don't got to toss enough money in front of him. He just got to, like, you know what I'm saying? Cause, Hype it enough. He had to, uh, talk to could be, and talk like, like I said, it was, it was his dad's, Dream fight, him if I could be. So Khabib so might, might be like. So Khabib could probably come out of retirement and say, "Okay, I'll do this. I'll do this fight for father. Like this, yeah. like, like yeah, fight yeah. for father. You know what I'm saying? Emotion to be easy. That'd be crazy, yeah, man. Be easy. That'd be the biggest fight in UFC history if, if that happened. Yeah, but I ain't gonna you know lie. I ain't gonna lie. It probably would. Yeah, I like that. I like that. <laughs> now, my pick. I almost did say Khabib, but it's definitely Devious and Figueroa. Uh -huh. Figueroa all day. Because, like I said earlier, the man has vicious highlights. You look at his highlights, and then the fact that he has the title, he's going to retain that and hold on to that title for a good while. Mm -hmm. I don't see nobody really beating him. The person, Shit, if, he, if he get a rematch with Moreno... That's the only person, though. That's literally the only person <laughs> I can think of. It, that's the flyweight division. That's the only person yeah. I can think of. I hope they Everybody do, else I hope they, they, they do, do that rematch. rematch. I'm, I'm, gonna, see one I'm definitely paying for that. I, I, everybody wants to see that rematch, honest to God. Hell yeah. 